I feel like someone that you would be interested in if you don't know him already is Peter Watts. One of the things that Peter Watts is into is this idea that he thinks that consciousness expands to the amount of neurons that are available to it. Have you ever heard of the Hogan twins in British Columbia? They're co-joined twins. Their brain is linked and they can tell jokes to one another with no words. They can also see through one another's eyes. If you use the twins from Canada as an example, what he's saying is happening with them is the way that their brain is linked, the data pipe isn't fat enough, right? It's more like dial-up rather than, you know, broadband. If you were to increase the volume of data of information being sent between the two brains, what would happen at a certain point is the two versions of self would dissolve into one united self. You would have one super organism that would be the consciousness of both. You can imagine a world where Neuralink talks about if you fuse hundreds of brains together in some kind of hive mind and everyone can think together, what may happen is you create a super intelligence that thinks of itself as I.